Hello, hello, Abi. I'll give Samson is here from wikito.com. And if today is your first time of seeing this, my video, please do me a favor to subscribe to this channel and like the video and make sure you leave a comment if there is any question or something that is not clear to you. And for those who are already subscribers to this channel, thank you so much. You being around motivates me to produce videos that I know are going to be beneficial to you. Quickly, I did a video, that's the video you are seeing on my screen, on how to create business email accounts on Gmail for free. And people have been contacting me that they run into an error following this video step by step. So I decided to try it myself and I ran into the same error. So I'm providing solution to that particular error. If you watch this video on my screen, and you still run into error, don't worry, there is a solution to it. Why that error occur, I actually don't know, but I think it's a problem with Gmail itself, and it's already fixed. So here is how to go about it. If you have watched this video, and you run into this error, you remember you come to account and support, and you click on add another email address, then you are going to put in your email, your official email, the domain you have created this is the custom domain and this is the official email you have created using improve ms do you remember this tutorial improve ms the uh, account we created here do you see it this is the account the, this is the alias we created using improve ms so you are going to add this to your gmail account which i'm doing here then you click on next now, once you click on next, then it's going to bring you to this SMTP server. We are going to use Gmail SMTP here. If you have watched this video, this video on my screen, you won't have problem doing all these setups. So, so once you are on the SMTP server, you are going to put in your Gmail server here, which you are seeing on the screen. Then you are going to put your email this particular email that you want to be receiving your official email. Do you understand? Your official email is going to be directed to this Gmail. This Gmail is going to be your own Gmail. In my case, this is the Gmail I want to direct this official email. This official email. This official email. I want to direct it to this Gmail. Do you see it? So that is the Gmail you are going to add here. And you are going to add a password to this Gmail here. So here is the password to this Gmail account. Then you click on add account. All right. This is the problem you are going to run at. Do you see it? I'm running at this problem, this particular problem, authentication field. Please check your username slash password and let's secure access to this particular Gmail. Now, my email is correct and my password is right. So you have to do two things. The first thing you need to do is to check if your let's secure app is on if you don't understand how to do this please make sure you watch this video that i did previously i'm going to leave a link to this video in the description below please make sure you watch it so that you can understand the process step by step so i'm going to copy the first link this link helps you to check if your let's secure app is on do you see it once you paste it here and you click enter see is showing that my less secure app is on. Even at that, I'm still running to this error. So the next thing you're gonna do is to copy the next code. I'm going to leave all this code in the description below. Just copy this code and paste it on your address bar again. See, just paste on your address bar. Then it's going to come up like this and allow and ask you to allow access to your Google account. Then click on continue. Once you have done this, you should not have any problem with linking your custom domain to your Gmail account. So now that we are here again, I'm going to enter my password again to this Gmail to confirm if what we have fixed there has solved the problem or not, you see. So I've input the password again. So I'm going to click on add account this time around. Awesome. Do you see? Everything went on fine. Once you are at this page, the next thing is to go into this Gmail account, your Gmail account, copy the verification code and click on verify. That is all you need to do. 
if you follow these steps and you still run into any problem, please leave it as a comment in the section below and I'm going to prefer solution to it as soon as possible. So I have come to the end of this video on how to solve this problem of adding custom email to your Gmail account. If you love this video, please give me a thumbs up, share this video and leave a comment.